A store owner thinks construction projects around the city are why thieves targeted his store. News 13 So Young Kim shows you the great lengths they went through to break in and what they're after. Thieves tried to break into this welding supply store a few months ago. The wrought iron door inside, and they couldn't pry that open. They couldn't get into it. And failed. But they got another idea and hit again early Saturday morning. Half the storefront was taken out. This time getting creative. There's a skid marks where they were spinning their tires to rip the the wrought iron out. Of and successfully breaking in. And they tied off with a, a chain or something and ripped everything out. The High Desert Industrial Store at the corner of Candelaria and Princeton sells welding equipment and tools. They took uh, welders from us. They took numerous carts from us. They took chop saws. They took tools. That's what the thieves were after, but why? The welders that we carry range anywhere from like $1,200 to $6,000. The owner of the shop says he thinks criminals are making a quick turn on these items at construction sites. They might go to job sites and where there's other welders and they might go over there and say, hey, I have a welder over here. And can make a couple hundred dollars. They pull that one, two, three bars. The owner says he's not the only one. He got broken into and they took his welder, they took his truck. He's now installing surveillance cameras. For us, it's, it's a big loss. So Young Kim, KRQE News 13. The owner says several other stores on the street have also been hit in recent months. He's talking to neighboring businesses in hopes of starting a neighborhood watch program.